What is the blast radius? Why does it matter? Why does it say spread? What are those settings? So today I'm going to let you visualize the blast radius in Gary's mod. So in an effort to explain what the blast radius is, I have constructed a few series of uh, structures in Gary's mod that represent uh, what you would normally see as memory domains in, in RTC. These are three memory domains, if you want. Let's call them domain 1, 2, and 3. No particular name. What is actually happening under the hood when you just press the corrupt button? What's happening? When you corrupt the game, and I'm talking like one corruption, the, a manual blast, the corrupt button in the glitch harvester, it uses the intensity specify how big the corruption is going to be. These, these units that are generated by RTC are going to be scattered all around the selected domain. This is, this is actually what the blast traders does. It lets you control how you want to distribute the corruption across the domain. While in the grand scheme of things, this does not have a lot of impact. These little tweaks can give corruptions a particular flavor. So we're going to start with spread, the default one. Spread is the default setting because it is just purely random. There's no, there's no order in which the corruption is going to be applied in the game. It's just, you know, completely random. Chunk is pretty much what it means. It's going to be a chunk of corruption that is going to be applied on a single domain per blast there. What does that mean? You press manual blast in RTC or the corrupt button in the glitch harvester. It's going to create a single blast layer full of corruption data ready to be unleashed upon the game. Auto corrupt. It will create a blast layer every frame. What Chunk is going to do is simply is going to select one of the selected domains. Just one. Again, per blast layer. If you press manual blast multiple times, the first time it will select a domain, and the next time it will select another burst. What What is burst? Burst is, it's kind of like, it's kind of like, hmm, Burst is 10 chunks of one-tenth of the total intensity. One, two, three, four, five. Even the simple one. One after the other, it's gonna blast something. And eventually, all the selected domains end up being corrupted the same way. Well, you know, not the same way. It's not the same addresses. It's not the same value. Proportional. It's gonna scatter the units across all the domains proportionally and it's gonna, gonna corrupt the big one a little bit more that's what proportional is iterate through all selected domains and apply intensity size of the largest domain divided by the size of the current domain yeah a bit like that 